Hello and welcome to your throat chakra yoga flow. Today we'll be focusing on strengthening and lengthening our neck, releasing and relaxing our upper, middle, and lower back. Let's begin in a comfortable seat. Tuning in to the sound of our breath. Letting go of the day so far. And what's happening in the future. And together we'll inhale as we allow our arms to rise overhead. And exhale, bringing our hands down to our mat, shrugging our shoulders. Again, let's inhale, arms come up. And exhale, hands come down. Our gaze is at the same level as our fingertips as we shrug our shoulders. Inhale, rise up. And exhale, releasing our hands back down to our mats rolling our shoulders back together as we inhale, hands come up, and exhale, hands come down to our mats, this time right arm comes up overhead, keeping our left hand firmly on our mat, we'll straighten our right arm out to the side as we feel an even deeper stretch in our neck. And on your next exhale, bringing that right arm across your body, touching your opposite knee as we inhale to a twist. And exhale, release a little bit deeper. Inhale, lengthen our crown to the sky. Exhale, twisting even deeper. Inhale, lengthen. And exhale, maybe rotating our neck even deeper. Making sure we are safe, we feel protected, and no pain. We'll slowly bring our neck back to center as our left arm comes up overhead. And exhale, right hand planted on our mat, left arm extended out. Inhale. Exhale. And exhale, bring our left arm across our body, gracing our right knee as we inhale, our spine lengthens. Exhale, twisting in our spine. Inhale, heart opens. Exhale, relaxing our shoulders down to the ground. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, release, coming back to center. Together, let's inhale, our palms come up overhead. Reaching, reaching, reaching all the way up to the sky. And exhale, bring our hands back down to our mat as we allow our neck to stay lifted. 
Allowing your neck to gently roll back, our gaze lifts up to our ceiling. Exhale, releasing our hands down to our mats as we look up. Feeling a nice deep stretch in the front of our neck. sure that we are not feeling any pain sensations in yoga are great but we're definitely not feeling any pain in anything that we're practicing pain is a sign that we need to ease up just a little bit maybe come out of the posture ever so slightly breathing really deeply here slowly begin shifting your gaze towards the front tracing an invisible line from your ceiling to the wall and the line goes down as we continue the journey now tucking our chin into our chest releasing our shoulders Our core is still engaged, but our head is very relaxed. Our neck completely drops. And we breathe. Inhale. Very, very slowly begin moving your palms out in front of you. Slowly releasing the soles of your feet now touch. We're going to thread our arms underneath our ankles, really round into our spine, completely relaxing. Feeling a nice opening stretch in our upper back. resistance between our forearms and our calves begin straightening your legs, allowing our feet to come out in front of us as we very, very slowly begin straightening our spine, slowly, slowly lifting 
our gaze up to the ceiling as our feet flex, palms behind our hips. We're pressing into the palms of our hands as we allow our neck to open even more deeply. gentle mobility we'll squeeze them all the way up to our ears and release them down inhale squeezing our shoulders all the way up and exhale big release letting go inhale squeeze even more deeply really squeezing 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 everything in our entire body as we uh, exhale letting it go one more time big squeeze all the way up and exhale coming down into a nice forward fold allowing our body to completely relax however we may fall attention back to our breath we begin to relax Shimotanasana. Seated forward fold. Focusing on our breath. Releasing any tension to the ground. Each breath 
vertebrae by vertebrae, using our core to lift us up. our seated position we'll come onto our hands and knees with our knees underneath our hips we'll begin by rotating our scapula just playing with our shoulders pressing into our hands rounding really focusing on just our shoulders starting with our tailbone rounding through the spine, releasing our neck last. Inhale as we rise. Exhale as we fall. Keep breathing and being with your slowly slowly bring your hands back in front of you as we crawl our way through keeping our chest low to the ground ass in the air we'll inhale pressing into our palms lifting all the way up and to exhale releasing into this cobra this is too much we can keep our elbows bent down on the ground and lift up slightly still getting great benefits and great great effects from this posture breathe and exhale slowly 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 bringing your chin in towards our chest lowering down to the ground Pressing firmly into our palms as we tuck our toes and push our way all the way up to a plank. Breathe. Engage your core. Squeeze your glutes. Really press through your palms, making sure that our elbows are not overextended. Still keeping a nice bend in our elbows we're pressing 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 through the soles of our feet so there's equal energy coming back through our feet and forwards out of our crown we breathe deeply and exhale bending our knees as we push back into downward facing dog really taking the time to stretch out through our shoulders and our back Inhale as we lengthen our neck, 
exhale releasing our head completely shaking our neck yes and no Inhale, we'll push through our tippy toes to come up and over into a plank. Holding straight and strong. Pressing into our palms, into our toes. Really engaging our core here. Exhale, bend through our knees and push back, downward facing dog, releasing the back of our neck, sinking into our arms, twisting towards the right, twisting towards the left, coming back through center, we push into our toes up and over into our plank, holding here straight and strong entire body is activated we're feeling alive feeling our strength knowing we can hold ourselves up and exhale bending through our knees downward facing dog maybe taking a longer stance as we stretch deeply into our shoulders Inhale, pushing into our tippy toes as we come up and over, back into plank. Breathing here. Releasing here. We'll slowly exhale as we bring our body down to our mats. Pushing into our palms as we inhale up, cobra. Puppy dog pose. Toes are pressed in. into downward facing dog inhale right leg lifts up exhale coming forward inhale up on Janayasana and exhale coming forward pressing back to our heels inhale forward exhale back downward facing dog reaches up to the sky. Exhale, bringing our knee in towards our chest. Inhale, Anjaneyasana. Exhale, planting our hands down to the mat as we press into the soles of our feet, pushing back, stretching into our calf, our hamstrings, our lower back. facing dog inhale right leg lifts up exhale coming forward inhale up on Janayasana and exhale coming forward pressing back to our heels inhale forward exhale back downward facing dog left leg lifts up as we inhale Exhale as we come forward. Inhale, lift up on Janayasana. Exhale, hands come down to our mat as we bring our hips back to our seat. Inhale, coming forward. Exhale, push back, downward facing dog. Inhale. 
Inhale, we'll step forward, left foot and right foot, bending our knees and bringing our seat down to our mat. So we move towards the front and slowly lower down, 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 until our back is flat. We bring our knees in towards our chest, wrapping our left arm around and our right arm around, bringing our chin in towards our knees. We'll squeeze, 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 and exhale, release down to the mat. Breathe, release, be. Slowly release her grip as our legs come flat onto our mats. Shift up onto our elbows. As we inhale, chin lifts up towards the ceiling. Exhale, release the right foot, release the left foot. You can stay right here or slowly allow your chin to lift up even more as the crown of our head reaches towards our mat. Breathe. Next inhale, slowly lower your head down to your mat. Inhale, lift our feet up towards the sky. Exhale, release our hips back. And exhale, feeling a really nice stretch in our whole spine. Breathe in Halasana, Plow Pose. Stay here, or if you have the space, bring your knees over your ears. slowly we'll begin our descent back to our mats vertebrae by vertebrae releasing our lower body sinking deeply let's windshield wiper our legs side to side Shift our hips up and over to the right side of our mat as our knees come over to the left. Supine twist. And slowly inhale, bring our knees back up to center. Shifting our hips up and over to the left as our knees come down to the right.
next inhale, bring our knees back up to center. And release in our final resting posture of Shavasana. But first we'll squeeze, squeeze, squeeze everything. Squeezing our toes, squeezing our feet, squeezing our core, our wrists, our ankles. Squeeze and creating lots and lots of tension. And release into Shavasana. Our final resting posture. Letting go of our practice. Letting go of our breath. Knowing we are exactly where we are meant to be. There's no difference between free will and destiny. Slowly begin deepening your breath. Rotating your neck left and right. Wiggling your fingertips and your toes. Taking a nice big stretch overhead. Bending our knees and coming up however we please. 
meeting together in a nice comfortable seat taking a few spinal rotations in one direction and shifting the other direction nice big circles with their spine Twisting over to the right, inhale, exhale, twist over to the left, inhale back to center, lifting our arms up, gathering all the transformative energy we've created, bringing it in towards our chest, bowing down the divine energy, divine flow within us all. When you're ready, pick yourself up and enjoy the rest of your day. I thank you for being here with me, sending lots of love and blessings your way.